It's an amazing bit of kit and you can use it in so many different ways. In the instruction manual that you get, you'll see a way of putting an opt-in form over the top of an authority site. So you can find an article on a authority site or any site um, that is related to a niche that you're building a list in and you can put an opt-in form over. It doesn't have to be an opt-in form, it can be a CPA offer, it can be all sorts of things. But for the video to show you how to use the product, I want to do something a little bit different. I want to show you another use for it that I've found, which is really valuable if you are uh, email marketing. Uh, that's the preparation I've done. So let's bring up the software now. And um, what I'm going to do here, the first thing it asks you for is enter the link to the authority page. This is the page where the article is or where uh, people are going to, to, to go and see whatever it is you, you're telling them about, okay? Um, so, in this instance, what I'm going to do is, this is the link I'm going to put in here. All right, now I'll click Next and enter the title you want displayed. I've just put in there, this is a test. Pop-up type, let's go for Delay. And I'm going to set it for five seconds. So people are starting to read the... Th and Next. 800 pixels wide. It's not very tall, so I'm going to set it at 450 pixels. I think the default in there is 500, but it's mine is not ever so tall, so I'm going to put it at 450. And I'm not going to bother with an image. Um, you could put an image in there if you if you're going to share this on Facebook or anything like that. You could put an image on there. And it pick an image from the actual article. Most articles have images in there. You can just choose something that's already on the article that you're, um, that you're showing people. Uh, this is put in by default and it's the excerpt from the article on the authority site and it's put in as, as what you put in previously as, um, as the test, as, as the text. So you can change this or you can leave it as it is. Normally that would be the title of the article that you're you're showing people. For this instance, um, I've just used it as a te test. So now it says create pages and it's going to ask me where to create them. So I go to that folder, that empty folder I made earlier, Stealth Demo, and just in a second or two and it's already made. Okay, so we can just minimize that now and here are our, our pages. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to bring up the FTP program. You can use whatever FTP program you like. Uh, I'm going to include this one. It may look a little bit different to this. I'm going to include this one in with the pack. It's very simple to use. And I've connected to my web server, and you can see it over this side. And I've already created here a folder called Stealth Demo. So let's open that up. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to click all of these holding down control so it selects all of them and I'm just going to drag them over and copy them into that folder in the FTP program okay so that is now copying into there only takes a second or two to do it and they're all there so now we can minimize that we called it stealth demo Okay, so enjoy the software. That's just one um, use of it that um, I've given you there, but there are tons and tons. If you imagine that you're sending, let's say, to an article on, I don't know, dog training, and halfway through the article, a little pop-up comes with a CPA offer for a dog training course or, a, or, or an invitation to join um, a dog training uh, newsletter, that's powerful. That's powerful because people think that it is the authority site that is creating that pop-up. So they treat it with a little bit more seriousness. So there you go. Have fun with it and uh, I hope it makes you a bunch of money. Thank you very much for watching.